So now for future projects, what are your goals for, for future projects in life? In life, okay. Life in general. What do you want to do in life? What do you want to succeed at well, in like, life? I'm in college right now, um, and I'm, I'm studying customer service. Customer service. So I'm literally looking for sports activities I organize. Or I'm very interested in organizing sports activities for every age. So I'm like, I'm interested in that realm. But, that's a, that's pretty that's a pretty yeah. cool pretty cool thing that I've never heard of. Really? Yeah, I've never heard of it's it. It's just like it's just like rec. You know oh. when you have to organize all that? Oh, so you just so it's like one of those like rec guys? Not not those rec guys, but that, like that's the closest to it. But it's like That's rec. good. Well, you see that guys, he is following that dream by going to school, getting that education. You get that education out there because Without an education, you can't go one, nowhere in one, life. One more semester until I graduate. One more semester until he graduates. Look at that. Hard work pays off. Like, give yourself a round of applause. Like, excellent. Excellent. Yes. But now, the verbal abuse now. Um, uh, it's, it's, it's going back. It's like I mean, I was happy for like a second. And, and now it's uh, back to verbal abuse. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. But with this verbal abuse, I, I'm assuming... That you probably talk to somebody about this verbal abuse because you can't be holding it all inside that mm. you take this every day. It like varies. Who do you talk to about your verbal like, abuse? Anybody that like would reach out to me or anybody I like I I sometimes cry out on social media. Sometimes I do that. Or or I just listen to music. I that really whatever music whatever whatever mood in the music it is, like if it's like a sad music it get, gets me more sad but like if it's like upbeat you can't you can control whatever you can control like that kind of beat that would f make me feel more better see guys he takes look at he's so emotional like he takes this verbal abuse <laughs> really bad and i'm trying to help him and i'm trying to help the people out there that take the same abuse as he does like serious abuse not like joking abuse because joking abuse is not as worse as, like, actual serious. Yeah, no, no doubt. Oh, yeah. No doubt. Okay. But now, what are some ways that you're going to solve these verbal abuse that you be taking? Like, for me? Yes, you. What are going to be some ways that you're going to improve on it? Make yourself a better person from it? I just well the way I the way I grew up is like with a great family and everything and it, it was never we never had problems. His family is great, guys. <laughs> really, really nice, humble people. I went to his house so, several times. Really good people. So, like I I learned from my parents and how to be a good person and uh, don't. Take and if people whatever. can't respect that, yeah. they can go fudge themselves. <laughs> yeah, fudge themselves. PG. We're staying PG. And mm -hmm. Eric's like. What the fudge <laughs> are you doing? I'm keeping it PG. Awesome. The only PG right. talk show on EM Studios mm -hmm. where we don't go, what the fuck? And I just yeah. F-bombed it. I should have said what the fudge, but I just failed. And it's not going to get censored. Uh, but oh well. Can't do anything about that. Can we? No, no, no. But now, my final question to you about verbal abuse. Okay. The final question is, mm -hmm. who are your top five people out there that give you the verbal abuse? Who's five? The five people. The five people. On throw them under, under the bus? Oh, yeah. What if they, like, really verbal abuse me, but now they're done, but they were on the top? Oh, well, just say the I top mean, five. All right, Will's definitely number one. Will's number one. I'm sorry. Will just does it on the daily. Like, through Will phone, does through person, daily. nothing. His running mate for Rookie of the Year. Um, <laughs> on DITV One's award show. I'm trying to think. Just threw a curveball at me. Um, yes, I did. That's what we do on Donnie's <laughs> Lounge. We like to throw curveballs. Not swerve balls, curveballs. I'll put, I'll, put, I'll put you at number three, though. Like, I'll put you in the middle. Like, you're not as worse, but, like... Man, you guys, you see that? I need a... I need a... I need a, I need a cool down. Gage is number two. Gage is number <laughs> two. Name some examples of Gage. Um, I mean, 
If I don't do everything he wants me to do, I'm a weakling for it, I guess. That's pretty much like if he if it's not if it's not up to him, it's always gonna be a problem to me. But if he doesn't bring it up, it's all good. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. so Gage is number two, I'm number three, who's number four and five? Oh man. It's a tight one, honestly. You know, my brother. <laughs> Your bro my brother. Oh, okay, what brother, what sister does not? Yeah, that's why I, I had to throw him in there. I had, had to, to throw him under the bus. He's not I'm as so, bad, so I'm so, I put four. I'm sorry, little Neil Jr. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, and number five. I think... It's just, it's just random. You can't forget about Minnie, Will, I Cam... Will. Cam. Uh, <laughs> Cam. I think he's worse than Will. I mean, I mean, he tries to verbal abuse me, but he makes no sense. Like, he literally makes no <laughs> sense. He, like, twists the words, like, uh, what? Were you trying to abuse me? So I don't know if that counts. But, like, I... Who's I, the last person? I, 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 I just say, like, pretty much just people that I barely know just come up and do it, pretty much. Like, I barely know. You see, at random people. I don't, I don't remember, like, their names, so it's, like, yeah. tough. So, it's just, see, like, anonymous those names for don't number matter. five. Number five is anonymous. Anonymous. So. Okay, that's awesome. But now, I have one more question. I was thinking while you were saying the five. You, you, you just, you just said this final, final question, like, twice my already, final but question, okay. It's, it's an easy one. Uh-huh. Who is the person that comes to the DITB1 household that doesn't abuse you as much Top three. Top I, I don't know. I even think there's a top three for that. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Um, Unless you can come up with three. That's not... Tyrone's number one. Tyrone? He's yeah, number he, one. He, he doesn't really come at me. Okay. Tyrone's number one, guys. Um. Oh. Number... Oh, my God. This is actually hard. Tyrone might be the only one. Wait. Um... This is sad. Oh, wait, no, 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 Karina is... definitely still roasts me. Karina's still... I mean, <laughs> I'm... Tyrone's the only person. Oh, you're, you're dead. Does my dad? Yeah. Well, out of all the people yeah. you could have thought of, he says my dad. <laughs> oh. That's sad. That is oh, sad. Oh. oh, and, and... I learned something from this episode. And, and Eric, of course. Eric's number two? Yeah, I'm disrespected. I think you forgot about one person. That doesn't, doesn't doesn't Alex not abuse you? It depends. Like, okay. if he if he's frustrated at a thing, he'll just tear it up on me, or like. So it's like not. You really. see, everyone puts their anger out on him. The poor I know, Neil. I poor am, Neil. I Hashtag am, poor Neil. I am, Hashtag poor Neil. I am the I am the pillow voice. they punch. I swear, <laughs> I am the pillow. Oh my god. And the feathers before. I'm a cushion. I'm a cushion. Just like <laughs> punching. I don't know. You know what? You better end it right there. There's no more questions, I, I right? Don't, I don't have okay. any more. I don't have any more questions. You're gonna say, wait, one more. But wait, there, there is one. Yeah, more. yeah, yeah, yeah. I just want you. I just want you to say. I have. I don't have one more question. I don't, I don't like messing with you. Uh, I just wanted to see your reaction. Are you gonna say a positive one? Before yeah, we yes. End but the video? my final thing. My final thing. I want to say, guys, before we close this episode of Donnie's Lounge off. Is anything you want to say, Neil, to the best ones peeps out there worldwide? Anything you want to say before you go? On the verbal abuse, don't let anybody take control of you, verbally don't. or physically. Don't. Just focus on yourself. They're not really your friend. If yourself. You really, if you really, if if you really want to hang with them, just because they have more friends, there's a bunch of people in this world. Don't that be you a follower. Be a leader. Be I mean. yourself. That's what we learn. That's what I teach on Donnie's Lounge. Yeah. But Neil, it was awesome having you on oh, the show. No, I no, definitely no. hope to I, have you again on here. I had fun. This I, set I needs to stay. Time. I think this set needs to stay. Needs to stay so. And I enjoyed this episode, guys. If you guys enjoyed this episode of Donnie's Lounge, splash the like button. If you have not hit the sub button yet to EM Studios, hit that sub button now because you're missing out on a good time. And also, hopefully, he puts um, the links down in the description below, too. So you can follow follow us on Twitter. You can follow Neil on Twitter, at Neil Sports Mind. You can follow me on Twitter, at Donnie Barnard. Links down in the description below. And to all the best ones out there, 
and peeps worldwide. <laughs> DITV1 EM Studios is taking over the YouTube game. See you guys later. See ya.